Stan Lee. What an amazing talent Stan Lee was. I remember as a kid watching the Spider-Man cartoon series, X-Men, Iron Man, Hulk, and playing arcade games that had the Avengers in them, and X-Men arcade games, Spider-Man video games, having action figures, reading the comics, of course, and learning about the creator of all these heroes, Stan Lee. What an amazing talent Stan Lee was to create all these heroes and make a change in the world for the better through these heroes to send positive messages to the kids and readers everywhere you know this message about superpowers super abilities and using them for good the good of others to help others to protect others to save lives against evil villains the rule is good superheroes have good supervillains so stanley created great supervillains for these heroes to triumph against and that's another positive message to kids, you know, to not give up, that you're not out of the fight, that you know when you're fighting for the good of others, you must fight with all of your heart and all of your strength. When Marvel superhero movies started taking off, I was really excited to see them. And now we have many good superhero movies. I remember as a kid attending a small comic convention in, in the 90s when my parents took me to one. And I didn't understand it all back then. Soon, when I was in college doing a student internship, I actually got a pass to attend my first Comic Con in San Diego. That was huge. I was completely excited, very much looking forward to it. And my first time there, I was just hanging out outside for a little while when, I, when the word of mouth spread that Stan Lee was signing autographs in a, in a nearby building. And I thought, oh, I got to run over there. So I ran over and... There was this uh, little sign-up process to get a, a little comic signed by Stan Lee, and I went through with it. Included an autograph by Stan, and a, if we wanted, a picture with Stan. And I had to ask the people in charge, is there a long line already? Like, uh, am I going to have to wait a while? And, and they said, nope, nope, only five people have signed up so far. So I thought, oh, I've got to do this. And, you know, and I, I, I filled it out, I, like, I made a payment. And, you know, and I, and I got in line real quick. And, and before I even got in line, I remember, like, like, the people in charge tell me, look, there he is right over there. And I look over, and there's Stan Lee, like, uh, looking at some of the memorabilia and then getting ready at his autograph table with his books ready to sign, ready to take photos, and the security surrounding him and the fans that were already waiting for him, the very few fans that were already waiting for him. So I got really lucky that I didn't have to wait that long and that I was guaranteed an autograph with him. I get in the line, and when it's my turn, I, you know, I'm, I'm like super excited. Like, he's already got the autograph. I didn't watch him sign it. Like, he, he had the autograph already written there. And, of course, I had to take a picture. I got my phone out. I hand it to a security guard, and I, like, I get ready for the picture. I put my hand on his shoulder, and before I get the picture with him, I, I tell him, Oh, I love your creatures, but uh, and I love you in the movie Mall Rats. And Stanley said, "Yes, wasn't I good in that?" <laughs> oh my gosh, I was I was like super excited. I was I was overwhelmed. It was a powerful experience for me, and I just I had to keep myself still to take this photo with him and and put my hand on his shoulder, and and the, that security guard takes the photo. And, and uh, I still can't get enough of them. <laughs> like I tell, I love the Spider-Man. I love all the X-Men cartoons when I was a kid. And I love your cameos in all your movies. <laughs> and I got, I got, I remember like having your, um, your, like, I remember having your coloring book when you were, I had your coloring book, like on how to, not your coloring book, but how to draw the superheroes. <laughs> and he's just like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 and and I, like, I, can't, I can't control myself, but you see, the security guards, they, they, they walk up to me and say, okay, it's time, it's time to let the next person go in, you've had your time, and, and, I, and I just say, okay, the security is making me go, and, you deserve a hug, and I hug him, <laughs> and he hugs me back, and he says, thank you, thank you very much, <laughs> and, and I step out, and, and uh, I walk out, I just, I try to, I, Catch my breath. I walk out the building. <laughs> oh my gosh! I took a picture with Stanley. <laughs> Stanley. <laughs> oh my gosh! Stanley. <sighs> and only two hours later, I got in to see the the Amazing Spider-Man panel, 
inside the Comic-Con building where I got to briefly speak to Andrew Garfield to see Stan Lee and see the new Spider-Man at the time. Those memories last forever. Now with the recent learning of the passing of Stan Lee, we say Excelsior. I say thank you for using your talents to make a change in the world for the better. You are an amazingly wonderful creator. Your creations will last forever. And meeting you was a very powerful experience. Excelsior. I'm a true believer. And I always will be among the many true believers. Mm -hmm.